What's going on, everybody? My name's Chris, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Ocarina of Time. In the last episode, we started tackling the freaking Shadow Temple, and holy crap, I'm going through this place pretty freaking quick, not even gonna lie. I don't know why I kind of turned to Mickey Mouse here, kind of, not really, sort of, I don't know. Oh, no! I'm slippery and sliding around. Uh, run, Link, run! Ugh! So yeah, that's how you make it to that platform. The more you know, um... Can we make it over here? Can we skip all this crap? Oh, we can. Cool. I think we want to go this way first. I don't even know how I never noticed these mice before, or these rats, or I guess they would be rats, actually. I don't give a rat's ass. Oh, no, we don't have a key. Well, that's unfortunate. Oh, no, I guess I did come over here for nothing. Well, then. That's embarrassing, but not really. Uh-oh. It was my end badly for me. Oh, that didn't actually do that much. Um... You know what? I'm gonna be smart and take off these boots. I was gonna try to go along these um, ledges with the boots, but that's probably a really dumb idea. Alright. So look at all these freaking spike tracks. If only I could explode this guy with an arrow. It's funny how in Wind Waker, the, the way you actually fight Beemos, or you can use the arrows on them. Actually, I, I, for a second I thought you couldn't use the bombs on them, but you actually can, so never mind. <laughs> I was gonna say, you can't use bombs on them, you have to use arrows. In this game, you can't use arrows on them, you have to use bombs. But that's not true at all. Hey, there's a hidden silver rupee in the enemy. Of course. That's it. Ow. Every freaking time, those spike traps just managed to be in the perfect spot to hit me. Alright, last one. Last bite. Ow! See what I mean? Don't! Don't fall off! Ah! I almost jumped off! I tried to pull back my control stick because I thought I was going to run off after the cutscene, but alas, I did no such thing. Alright. Hey, it's a spike room! Only one with the Eye of Truth will find the stone umbrella that protects against the rain of blades. That's really cool, too. Uh, Eye of Truth, eh? I already have that in my inventory. So silly me. Oh, I get it. I accidentally did that. I wonder if I could have grabbed that without using the lines of truth. Probably, actually. Alright. Holy crap, look at all these treasure chests in here. So, if you get hit by these blades, you immediately die. They don't die. It just... Uh, it's it's um, it's the same thing as falling in a pit, actually. That's what that does. Uh, is there anything in here? Nope. Conforms. Conforms. Alright, so let's stop the rain of blades, please. There's actually a sweet spot you can put this that it'll stop both blades, I believe, right? Ah! That scared me. I was like, wait a minute. That is going to work, right? <laughs> and for a second, I thought it wasn't. Oh man, I hate skull chills that are like, like walk from back here. I started walking like, oh man, there's totally gonna be a trap here, and there never was. Ow! You dink. That's what I was trying to do. Can I reach out? With oh man, <laughs> I have too many items now. I hate going back to my sub screen every ten seconds and grabbing something I don't have on me. No, there we go. I was shot an arrow at that token. That would have been silly. How very silly of me. Uh, is there anything in this room? I guess all these chests probably just contain useless crap, but I'm not gonna take that risk. Yeah, arrows. I think, I think that actually might be a key in one of them, so maybe I'm lying. Ah! Don't touch me! <laughs> that was the slowest spike track ever. Spike trap ever, and I still got hit by it. Um, Alright. So instead of continuing to push this block, what you're gonna wanna do is go behind it now and pull it. Because if you kept pushing it, then that spike, that spikes back there will come and hit you in the face. They come and hit me in face, I don't feel good. I don't know what that was supposed to be. Hmm. Alright. Climb it up. Climbing on up. Is there a chest over here? Is there a chest over there? Might be. There might be indubitably. Can I make that? I don't know if I can make that. I might be able to do it with the, the butter boots. Give me thy butter boots. Yay, Butterboot power! Is there seriously nothing here? That was a weird spin attack. I almost felt like slowed down or something. Seriously, there's nothing here. I mean, it looks like on my map there's supposed to be. What am I missing? What is this? Oh, you know what? There's that switch over there. I bet that has something to do with it. Thankfully, we can walk on those. Whoa! Wait. Wait, hold on, what's, what's the thing? Oh, okay, you just stopped one. I was like, what happened if I go on that switch? Why well, I just kind of float above it until I stop floating and then go down it? I guess I haven't really shown how 
The hover boots don't float forever, have I? I guess I might have. Oh, I'll show that in a second. Alright, so let's summon that chest over there. Alright, so you float, you float, and then you fall. I guess I did kind of show that, didn't I? I don't freaking know. Whatever! I got the key! Uh, can I continue on in this room? Is there anything more in this room? <laughs> that scared me. <laughs> it's over here. Nothing, huh? Interesting. Alright, can we please take these stupid butter boots off? Uh, we're just in there. No, that's it! That's it for this room! Good to know. Stupid rain of blades. You know what? I don't even care if it hit me! Hit me! Hit me! <laughs> yeah, so that's what happens when you get hit by them. And there's a bunch of hearts. But you get to keep all the stuff, so whatever. <laughs> Yay, shortcuts, but not really. Well, actually, that is probably a shortcut just because I would have had to use the, um... Um... The, the block to get back there. Alright, so now we have a key, you can go this way! The way we didn't go before. Alright, we should... But do I need the hover boots for this? Probably. Let's just put them on. I, know, I hate using them, even though I hate them! I hate them! I guess it would be smart to use them just to get on this ledge here. Because you never know when you're gonna need to... Or where you're gonna need to run to. I think I'm just cruising through this... Temple. Ha! Ah, spikes! <laughs> I hate you! Oh man, I love how easy these guys die. Wait, do these... Oh yeah, with the hover boots, you actually kind of hover over the spikes, which is cool. Oh! Dude, the way those sparkles appear, that looks like there's gonna be a big chest going there, but nope, there's not. I guess the hover boots are useful for this room, just because they help you... Or they fall over the spikes, for whatever reason. No one seems to understand why. I guess let's do this. I did it! Yay! Alright, there's another one right here. I believe there's a sculpture in this room as well. I think. Maybe. Ah, there's like a platform up there. Is there oh, I see. Ah, see? There's a secret hookshot target there. But you guys didn't see that coming, did you? Unless you did, in case. Good job! I'm proud of you. As your mother, I'm proud. You know, I'm gonna make sure. Room with falling spikes, room with large skull on fire. Uh, okay, nope. We're good. We're good. Okay, I, I was making double sure that we were good, and we are indeed good. Look at this weird ass skull. Isn't a weird and an ass and a skull? I guess so, I don't really know. Alright, let's crawl up here. Let's see, we got. I thought I heard a uh, wall master for a second, or a floor master. I guess it would be a floor master. So it's confusing because a wall master, and there's a floor master. Like, actually, I don't actually don't know which one is which. I mean, I thought a floor master would be because it falls from the roof to the floor, but then the other ones are just kind of on the floor, anyways. Oh, I think I hear a skull chilomata. Hey, there's a skull chilomata in this room that I didn't remember. Oh no, I, I see you guys are coming towards me. I'm just gonna pull my bow and arrow. <laughs> there's, there's no point in forcing myself to do this crap. Oh man, I'm not gonna be able to hit these guys. Dude, come on, come on. Come here, puppy. Seriously? Oh man, you're gonna really make me do this to Tendo? Seriously? Can you guys just fly towards me, please? Come on, see me! See me! Notice me, senpai! Aw, oh, come on, I hit you! Okay, that those flames are apparently solid. There we go. What did I accomplish? Okay. I accomplish anything else? Doesn't feel like it. Doesn't look like it. What is in this room? Nothing apparently. Uh, it's a bomb! Oh no 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 no! Okay, you know what? You, sir, need to leave. Just leave. Never come back. Leave now, and never come back! As Mr. Smaggle would say. Alright, so I threw a bomb in there. And the key explodes out of it! Yay! And I do hear a sculpture. There it is! Oh, there's a sculpture on the top here. Interesting. Oh, okay. It's skull on fire behind skull. That skull on fire. Okay, that's why my list said behind the skull on fire. 
I was like, wait a minute, was that even on my list? I was really confused, actually. Ow! I don't have the hover boots on anymore. Oh, there's a hook truck target up there. Is that, is that visible? I don't freaking know. Let's grab my freaking long shot. Long shot. The longest of all long shots. Aha, it's out there. I really wanted to see, actually. I didn't think unactivating my Blunts of Truth would actually get rid of, cancel my long shot shot, but it did shot shot. Uh -huh. ah, ah, ah. Okay, so it's weird that this is a thing because this doesn't recover the hover boots, it recovers the opposite, it recovers the iron boots. Because these fans all, well, appear to be going really slow, actually generate enough air to force you forward. Alright, come on. Die! I didn't even need to do a jump attack, I don't know why I even bothered wasting that. Alright, let's keep walking. Aha! Oh man, this is gonna suck. Alright, so we gotta wait for you. These things are bats! Look at them! Or maybe they're just demons. Or maybe they're bat demons. Oh my lord. Let's just go with that one. Aha! Okay, now you stopped. So I take off the hover boots. Or we put on the hover boots, rather. And we run! Uh, 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 that was scary. That was really scary. I never want to do it. Oh my good lord. <laughs> I'll just say, I never want to do it again. Well, here we go. Nothing in here. Why do these look like this? What the heck? I don't remember that at all. That is weird, but okay. Can I... What happens when I hit that? Does that just deactivate the fire? The fire, Will Robinson? I probably shouldn't take off my... My lens of viewing truth. Why is there a lens flare in here? Oh, do I have to be far away? Is it close or I'm too close? Roll! Um... Ow. Alright, let's hurry up here. Hello? Do I have to- Oh, what? Heh! <laughs> okay, it just explodes. Dude, come- Oh, ah, no! Holy crap! That was scary. I never want to go through that moment again. Oh, look at the mini-map. Looks like there's a room over here. Is that true? I don't remember this at all. There is. Well then, what's through here? Hold on, let's take a look at our map here. Okay. It, it looks like I'd pro. Yeah, it looks like I'm gonna want to go this way first because this just leads to a dead end. It leads to a DE. A dead end. I'm gonna take off my iron boots because I don't need them anymore. They have been taken off. Conformed. Yep. You're next. Wow, that doesn't even give them time to attack. That's almost sad on their part. Really? Is that it? Is there nothing in here? Oh, yes, there is. Haha, -ha, you almost tricked me. What do you say? Here, I could hear the spirits whispering, and I know that's Navi. Those who have sacred feet should let the wind guide them. Then they will be led to the hidden path. That's what they are saying. Good call, good call, evil demon speaking to me from hell itself. Arrows! That's pathetic! Yay! <laughs> yeah. Ah! Stop playing me on fire immediately before you even have time to respond, you dick! Ah! Ah! That was scary, man! I couldn't see where I was going! I don't wanna die! I'm too young to die, man! This is the room I remember. Oh no! Okay, well, you got time to attack. Hope you're happy, Gibdo, because that was the last attack. Well, okay, this is the last attack you'll ever get, actually. Can you just drop millions of hearts, please? Ha ha ha! Ah, the cutscene made that pot not have an effect on me. Yeah, I did it. And here is the distraction chest. Because if I remember correctly, we'll open this chest and we'll get. <gasps> Five rupees, I think. Holy crap! I didn't know how I remember that. Cool. <laughs> like that hurts. But if you look at our uh, map, there's still a an item here. If you actually look at this, is there's a crack in that mound. And you pull it up, and there's still nothing there. And that's because you have to open the chest. This is the sneakiest chest ever, and I hate it. I hate it with a passion. We we'll say a flaming passion, but like that's that's weird. <laughs> um, yeah. 
And that's it for this room. So that's the Trixky dungeon room that everybody hates and hates and hates. Holy crap, we're actually almost to the end of the dungeon already. That is weird. I have to figure out where the sculpture is as well. Yeah, I hear it! I hear it! I hear you! I hear you, little guy! What do you say? Say anything? No? Weird. Every time we see one of those crazy, demented, skull faced dudes, they say something. I think the face on the wall there is actually the same face that was on those flaming skull head that, I, that there was a sculpture behind. Heh. Yeah. The more I know. Alright, so then I have a shortcut, thankfully. Hmm. I don't think I knew about the shortcut before, because I remember dying to the boss and then going through all this crap over and over again, taking forever to get back to the boss room. But no, this seems to be a bit of a quicker way, actually. <laughs> I don't even know how I would forget about it, because it looks kind of like a necessary shortcut, actually. Because they make you do that to get up here. That's the only way to get onto this boat! Yep, there's a freaking boat, a ferry. That's really cool. Okay, so this, I really hope works. Because I haven't been doing this in the other dungeons that's required. I'm going to try it out. Oh man, this might suck. Hold on, I need to look at my notes here. and see, Scarecrow Song. Okay, looks like left, down, right, up. Did I do it? Yes! The Scarecrow song! What? Really? No! Navi, go over there! Navi? I need you to go over there, Navi! Navi! There we go. What is going on here? Do I do it from the boat? I don't think so. Maybe I do. Maybe it's the other way. There we go. I was like, wait, am I getting this or not? <laughs> I hate the Scarecrow song. It always gives me issues. Always, 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 always. How do I activate it? Navi! At least I'm getting it. No, wrong way. Oh man. There we go. Is that gonna work, please? I don't know where to do this from. Oh come on, really? I thought I thought for sure I actually do it on this platform, but it's not working. You need to stop flying over here, you dick. <laughs> Navi the dickhead. Is it down here for some reason? Alright, I'll see you guys in a second so I figure this crap out. Oh man. Navi's clearly very, very, very clearly flying over there. And I'm playing the Scarecrow song. Do I do something wrong with the Scarecrow song? Do I have to go talk to Pierre again for some stupid ass reason? That's like, I play it and then Navi flies back over here. I have to look up the Scarecrow song or something, I don't know what else to do. This is why I absolutely hate the Scarecrow song bullshit. Cause it never fucking works! I'm so mad! I talked to the stupid Scarecrow. I don't get why it's not working. God damn it, I'm gonna have to come back here too. I'm gonna have to go back to like every single dungeon and play the stupid Scarecrow song at every freaking dungeon. It's gonna be the most obnoxious thing ever. Ah, oh, so freaking obnoxious. I don't. Now he flew back there for like a fraction of a second. I don't care what she keeps flying back to me. Ah, I may as well pull out my fucking hair. Is she back over there? Yes. Why don't you stay over there, you fairy whore? <laughs> oh, I'm so mad. I don't get it. It's stupid. Stop mocking me, damn it! Do I have to do it from this block? Maybe everything I'm reading is say do it from the boat. I tried that. It's not working. I'll try it from the block. Started from the block. Now I'm here. Started from the block. Now I'm gonna murder entire freaking my uh, a doggy family is what I was gonna say. <laughs> like that was really dumb and really offensive. Thanks a lot for watching the next episode. We'll freaking go on this freaking boat. Forget all about that stupid scarecrow bullshit. Now I guess I'll have to come back to every fucking temple. 
Play at every fucking temple! I'm sorry, I shouldn't be so mad. On the bright side, we'll finish off the, this temple in the next episode, so that's cool. Okay, bye! Wee! Boat! Yay! Fuck you, Skulltula!